Villages around Guiani and Limpopo are still without clean drinking water. That's due to the delay in a bulk water supply project aimed at drawing water from the Nandoni Dam. Government has already spent 2.3 billion rand on the project, but residents are yet to see a drop of water. Mike Marenga is in Guiani to check the pro progress. Apsheni Boti, what's the latest? <laughs> Option the three and option to the viewers. Uh, let me indicate that we are talking a project that started as early as 2010. It's been 10 years. The project is still incomplete. Um, the pa uh, Parliamentary Portfolio Committee on Water and Sanitation was here to check the progress as to how far is the bulk water supply project from Nandoni to Guiani. And the indication was that they had about 90% and that about 22 villages are receiving water. We've been driving around. Uh, fortunately, in the past three days, it was bucketing yet they had rain, they managed to harvest water to use at least for this week. But the big question is, what will then happen after a week? Because we know most of these villages here, more than 50 villages, are still without uh, clean uh, uh, drinking water. And this is one of the uh, uh, areas where this project is still underway. They are still trying to connect from Nandoni to Nsami Dam. Let me quickly talk to one of the construction workers here to tell us about the, uh, the, the, the project itself, if it's indeed at 90% and what the expectation is supposed to be. Uh, Baloi, I have a to President Ramaphosa i ya na President Ramaphosa President September. Until further notice, I'm going to that we are learning to that we are going to see 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 Oh, you man, very government. I look at the Mali, I kill the Pelele, the Pelela in Nick Faranan, Senaya in Inga Sabu, Inga M8. I look at the way Nikusukela last year. I ought to say M8, Ikaya Kela in Abatir. Let's look at the Matrina. I couldn't see it. That's Tengani Baloi, one of the construction workers. Uh, what he was briefly saying is that uh, there's an expectation that by September all the villages around Guyan will be having uh, uh, clean water. But uh, he's saying that it's impossible looking at how far they've gone in uh, when looking at the project itself uh, from 2010 up until now to say that um, what we have been told that the project is about 90% complete. It's not correct. It will take about two to three years. So what he was saying to the locals is that they must not expect any miracles today. Even when President addresses the nation this late this afternoon to talk about the Guiani water issue. He must be clear, he must be honest with the people of Guiani to say they will not have water, they must not expect water. He also quickly touched on this uh, project behind us to say they have been given a notice for about two weeks to say after two weeks they will have to uh, suspend their operations up until further notice because uh, it appears as if there is no money to pay the main contractor and the subcontractors who have been working on site for a very long time. So we shall hear what the president will say uh, later on tonight about the Guian water, the Nandoni bulk water supply because as it is now there is no water and it looks like people are still going to wait. That's right. Ikenzangov Bote Mike Maringa there coming to us from Guiani.